Today is November 15, 2013, and we are going up from Bakersfield to San Jose because we have a health fair this weekend in Berkeley. Um, so hopefully we'll be able to make a huge impact on the community. Hi, Chrissy. Hi. What's happening? <laughs> Trying to get us to San Jose as fast as possible. What time is it? 10.30. <gasps> so we'll get there at 2.30. Wow. You mean 2.30 a.m.? Yes. Okay. It's going to be a long drive, so good thing we have good company. Guess who it is? <laughs> Hi. State your name. My name's Annie. My name is Pretty Pretty Dinya. Hi, I'm Susan. Carmen. My name is Mary Janine. Joanna. Hi, I'm Anna. Christina. My name is Larry. Hi, my name is Chrissy. Shelly. Uh, my name is Kenny. Hi, I'm Janet. I'm Tao. Stephanie. You know my name. <laughs> What's your name? The, the audience doesn't know your name. They can read. <laughs> I'm a third year. Okay, and I'm a third year pharmacy student. Um, third year? I'm a third year. I'm, I guess, a super senior. So you are a pharmacist? I guess so. I'm a first year. I'm a first year. Uh, I'm a second year. <laughs> I'm a third year. Third year. Uh, I'm a third year. A second year. Uh, many years. I'm here at the Medicare Health Fair, and my favorite part about it is just helping people and seeing that they're taking their medications right and that they're happy when they leave here. We're saving people money and helping them smile. Doing medication therapy management, interventions, and Medicare plan evaluation. In addition to flyering to get more people to come to this amazing health fair. I'm just talking with the patients and helping them out. Because we took this class last year, it's nice to be back. It's very colorful. The chairs are colorful, there's lanterns. It's very spacious, too, which is nice. Um, the location? <laughs> <laughs> Not meeting. <laughs> and of course, meeting patients and seeing their years come back. Actually, I was um, just with a patient who, um, she was an incredible, incredible patient. She actually was born with cerebral palsy and um, was one of the most inspiring people that I've met today. She, um, she has three master's degrees from different universities, has written four books, and uh, totally embraces the the idea of life and doesn't let her disability ever debilitate her, debilitate her in any way. So she's a very inspiring person. Um, she's also really, um, really healthy and only and puts all of her her positive attitude into everything that she does. And um, it was really great to spend some time with her and just to get a little bit of advice from from uh, somebody that I'd never that I'd never be able to encounter otherwise. So definitely a huge highlight of my day. For Medicare, saving people money. <laughs> Oh, I'm excited to see everyone, which I've seen most of the people. Especially. <laughs> oh, <yeah. laughs> the food. What did you have? I had a really good hot dog. It was like the best hot dog I've ever eaten in my life. Do you like this hot dog better than Costco hot dogs? I do. What? Yeah, Costco hot dogs are good, but this one was better. Sorry. Okay, but what are you most excited about for the health fair? The fact that it's almost over. <laughs> There's the blue crew, army, and then there's Team Teal, and then Berry Challenged. Mm. You're not Berry Challenged. <laughs> okay, what would you call yourself then? Very, very fantastic. <laughs> Teal something. Team Teal. Team Teal. I like Berry Challenge. <laughs> but they're Berry Challenge. But they're, it's like a Berry Challenge. Barbie. Team Teal! Say it again. Team Teal! Berry Challenge. Um, hmm. The favorite name? I don't know what was our name. Team Teal. Berry Challenge? Can you well, of course, of course. Can you explain? <laughs> 
saying that, by the way. Why are you guys called Berry Challenge? I don't know. I've never heard that before. <laughs> what do you guys call yourselves, son? Oh, I don't know if we had a name. We just say Team Berry, Wild Berry. Is it Wild Berry? Deep Berry? Wild Berry? I'm sorry, I'm the wrong person. <laughs> Can you explain why Dr. Patel calls you guys very challenged? I don't know why he calls you that. Can you explain why your why your class name is very challenged? Because Dr. Patel thinks you're stupid. Oh, we're not that stupid. Say something to Dr. Patel. Dr. Patel, thank you for giving us this opportunity to help beneficiaries and the people of these different communities. And we've had a really great semester preparing and getting to do outreach and interact with a variety of patients. And yeah. Can you explain why you're not wearing a shield? <laughs> I packed it and apparently I didn't pack it and Kim had to call me out. Is so. it is it because you don't like um, the polo color? Yeah, I would I would prefer to be You wanna be very very challenged. challenged. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Hi. Right now we're on the rooftop of um, the facility that we're at. Um, we're at the health fair right now. Um, everyone's taking a break for lunch. <laughs> And then on, on the phone, I was like, yes! I'm going to be in the video. Hello, life is beautiful. <laughs> Who's your favorite Medicare student? I haven't met them yet. <laughs> um, what did you eat for lunch? <laughs> A delicious kielbasa hot dog. Can you explain to the audience why it wasn't from Costco? <laughs> because Costco does not have veggie hot dogs and we need to accommodate the appetite and dietary patterns for everyone. Couldn't we have just given them bread? Yeah. What's your name? Hi, I'm Susan. I'm helping with the health flare. Health flare? Health fair. What's the next question? Life is beautiful. You only get five seconds of fame or <laughs> This is more than five seconds. <laughs> we'll cut it. Oh, no. I see how it is. Okay, who next? I really don't know. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Hi. Hi. This is from Top Dog. But it's apparently like a famous hot dog place. But I have to say, I'm not that impressed. Hmm. Costco's got too bad. good hot dogs. <laughs> Oh, oh yes. Let me show you my clipboard, everyone. Could you read it now? I, I couldn't read the font, but I could read the big font. <laughs> this font is too small. No, it's not. Oh, good. Can you film it yeah. so I can read it yeah. off your uh, camera? <laughs> okay, well, I need no. to take a picture of it. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay, say bye to the camera. That's it? Yeah. I'm done with my segment. I would just like to say, since every one of your videos looks like you guys are inside a cardboard box, <laughs> now you can see that they're actually not held hostage and they're free. <laughs> so, thank you. <laughs> take two. Take okay. go. Yeah. Thanks yeah. for accepting all of our a lot of the events. We really appreciate it. No problem. It. <laughs> That's wonderful. Yeah. Let's see what's inside. Paper. I love paper. We knew it. We know you so well. We know so you so well. Paper. We just love oh, paper. Oh, dude. It's like the bomb. You know? What is it? It's a uh, Trader Joe's kettle corn. Still, why is there girl hair? <laughs> <laughs> there's like, there's like girls yeah. here. You don't see it. Go ahead, Kenny. Just don't mind. The that. Green, green mango peach tea. Your favorite, right? It's going to wake me up every Your morning. Your favorite, for right? Yeah, of course. <laughs> Love fruity tea. Yay. Bag. It's like everyone else. I get to match now. <laughs> yeah, you get to what I'm Finally, we have what looks like a candle holder or a, a mug. porch or a, a, mug. a cool mug for my tea. For this? For this? Yeah, for my tea. Hold we'll this it together. It stays, it stays hotter longer like me. Oh my god. <laughs> What's your 
first bunch today. No comment. <laughs> Dang. Oh, there is? Okay. Well, I probably won't read it in front of the camera. <laughs> Thank you, everyone. you describe your entire Medicare experience? My entire Medicare experience? Uh, it's definitely been the highlight of my pharmacy experience so far and it's, um, it's something that not a lot of people get the advantage of experiencing and not a lot of people get to um, get to learn from. It's, it's different than learning in a classroom and it's different than kind of just reading books and, and studying but it's more of it's more it's more actually putting things into practice and doing outreach and, and touching people's lives in different ways. So I really I really enjoy it, I really appreciate it and I'm really lucky to have the opportunity to do that um, for the past few few weeks and few months. And um, it's so uh, it's an experience I'll never forget.